Hello, everyone. This is Tom Nook. Uh, yes, April 12th. Now for today's news. Wow, no news? Alright, thanks, Tom. By the way, island friends, I'd like to share a little info. Oh, okay. What are we saying? Oh, closet or wardrobe. Alright. A little fashion show. Yada, yada, yada. Thank you. Goodbye, Tom. Yeah, so I time traveled by a week because we are still lagging behind just a bit. So better to get caught up than not. Here we are. Happy Home Academy. Rank B. All right. And Mother. Here, Balls and Petals. A smile graces my face as I watch the petals fall. All is well until... Oh, a chew. I, did, I was like, where are we going with this? What else? Oh, I just have excess money. Okay. Wood burning stove. That's cute. In mom's tissue box. All right. Uh, let me put these away quick. All right. Um, right. I'll put in storage. Put in storage. And leave. All right. Let's go see what the neighbors are up to. Hi, Boone. Oh, if it isn't chaotic. It's been a while. Yeah, I guess it's been a week in time travel time. Or, y you know what I mean. Are those... <laughs> I don't think those are new clothes. Uh, thank you, though. <laughs> they really show off your biceps. Um, and where is Miss Cherry? Oh, there's two of them. I... <laughs> okay. <laughs> there we go. I got a darner. Let me grab this message in a bottle. And then I think this is also a darner, but it flew... Oh. Nope, that's a butterfly. Yeah, it flew away. Alright, let me grab this money. Holy crap. Yeah, I have too much money in my pockets. I'll have to put some of this in the bank or something. There's another spot. It looks like Cherry's home. I'll pay her a visit. Knockity knock. Hi, Cherry. What you up to? Yo, Periodic, how are you? Haven't caught up in a while. Nobody's seen you here in like weeks. It's only been one. Give it a rest. <laughs> what were you doing? Don't tell me you, you were just spaced out in front of the TV all this time. Because I totally would have joined you. Alright. <laughs> Still got more to say? What, what? Uh, yeah, I just want to chat. I'm loving how clean and simple your striped tea looks. I'm not sure that's a style I can rock, but it's got a super refreshing feel on you. What, what? I'm pretty sure I've been wearing this for several uh, playthroughs now, so it's not really that fresh. But thank you. It's still kind. It's still nice. Oh, look at my tulips. They're pretty. All right. I got to see what's uh, in this bottle. To a friend I've yet to meet, I found this DIY recipe written in my dream journal this morning. I don't remember writing it down. I tried the recipe myself and loved it, so it seemed worth sharing out. Try it if you have the materials. Peaches. Handicraft silver. Wait, peaches. Thank you. Anyway, I got a DIY recipe for a wooden block bed. Is this part of the basic set? I guess not. Cool. Let me just let you go. I guess I'll let this uh, darner go too. Because they've already been got. God, that's like three blue bottles. <laughs> Where is the biodiversity in this place? I want to see something new. That's something new, but I've already got it. Wait, when do I get the ladder again? Should be soon, right? I can't wait to explore the upper levels of this place. Oh, hello. A vast storms are coming. Well, we, we get it. <laughs> Just skip to the part where you wake up, please. Thank you. S shut up. There's <laughs> so many words. Okay. Cool. There's one. Aww. Oh, no. Here goes my shovel. Alright. Well, I can't continue until I get a new one, so I'll be right back. <gasps> oh. That's something new, I think. <laughs> yes. A Madagascan sunset moth. Wow, you're not from around here. Have I got you? I, I really don't remember. Because it's actually been a few days since I even played the game. And I don't 
remember what all I've caught. So if that tells you anything, yeah. Anyway, let's drop these things off. Hello. Yes, I have one, two, three, four. I don't know what this accent is, but... <laughs> Hooray! Alright. Yes, um, okay. I have the moth, and what is this? Brachial pelvis, cool. Hooray, thanks blathers. Nope, I'm good, goodbye. See you later. Alright. To Nook's Cranny. Yeah, it's kind of it for now. I have so much freaking money. Sold. Espresso maker. I have whatever plant this is. A yucca. Hmm. Alright. And then maybe I'll have this bed. God, now my inventory is more full than before. See you later. I'm gonna drop these off at my house. Let's see. Alright, let's get out of here. You know what? I totally forgot to finish the uh, little quest that I'm doing right now. I gotta finish finding all those, uh, oops, communicator parts. There we go. Hey, there's a money hole. Alright, you're coming with me. Is there anything around here? Oop, there's a spot. Oops, I overshot. <laughs> Hold on, Gulliver. I'm looking. Oop. There we go. It's number three. Here we go. Alright. Let's go talk to this bird. Hello. Hey, did you find him? Got him right here. There you go. Good day. Okay. Well, let's just plant the money tree like right here, maybe. There we go. Hello, Tom. Yes, of course. Don't worry about a thing. We can set up your getaway package to include a lovely furnished home. Mm-hmm. Oh, not at all. We'll set up your move-in date at a later time. No, no, no trouble at all. I just need to drop the proper contracts. Understood. We will get back to you very soon. Thank you. Chaotic. Sorry to keep you waiting. I... Suppose you overheard that call I just got. For some time now, we've been advertising the Grandania getaway package. And wouldn't you know, out of the blue, we have three interested parties. That's great. Yes, yes, it's quite wonderful. Thank you, thank you. Er, wonderful except for one minor little detail. None of our applicants are too fond of the notion of sleeping in tents, you see. I'm afraid I got caught up in, in the excitement of persuading them to move here, and I may have... Promise them fully furnished homes. Three homes, setting aside the land, preparing all the furnishings, it's just too much for one one raccoon. So you're going to lay it on me to do the task for you. Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. <laughs> but chaotic. Here you are, in my hour of need. It's all... Oh, I was going to say, it's almost like he just fell into my lap. It most certainly must be fate. Would you help me get these homes prepared? All three of them? Of course, I will have to give you a good and proper thank you for your assistance. I guess, as if I have a choice, <laughs> of course. Thank you, thank you so much. I'll never forget this. Oh, you're going to need some top secret instructions. When you're ready, come talk to me. Use the phrase, what should I do? Agent, look out. Oh, this is fun. Thank you, I'm just going to deposit some bills. Maybe order a few things, I don't know. <laughs> Um, A, B, D. A, B, D. Hmm. Maybe I'll do the majority of this as my loan payment. Um, like a hundred and twenty. Well, no, a hundred fifty grand. Yeah. Confirm. There we go. Um, let's redeem some Nook Miles. I guess we'll do Island Life 101 since I missed that before. Your app has been installed. Hooray. Now I'll get lots of helpful advice and info on living here through my look phone. Great. I have more things to get. Hooray. Uh, custom pr design pearl editor. There we go. Here we go. 
Custom designs. Let's do top eight pop hairstyles. I want to see what that's all about. Redeem. Yeah, let's get the cool hairstyles. Redeem. Um, yeah. Oh, I don't have enough petals to make the picnic set, and it's kind of late. Oh, well. Oh, yes. The moment. The moment has come. Yeah, I got it. I got a fly. I caught a fly. I was just swinging it. I don't know how much of a, a likelihood it has to spawn, but I'm glad it did. There's a lot of butterflies over here. Blue bottle, blue bottle. Tiger. Yellow. We got those. We're good. Ooh. I got a guppy. Welcome to the team, newbie. So pretty and blue. I can't relate. Ooh, the vibration is strong. Oh my. Is that a tuna? I caught a tuna. It's a little off key. <laughs> anyway, it's a big old fish. I'm getting all these pale chubs. That's ridiculous. R. Well, time to donate. I have returned. Alright, we got a tuna, a fly, and a guppy. What a trio. Thank you. Nope, we're good. Goodbye. Alright, let's continue our progress. Hello again. Hello, hello. What would you like to talk to me about? Um, yes, what should I do? Oh, so you're already ready to help me prepare. Here's what I'm thinking. We really should start by building a bridge across the river somewhere. Oh, finally. With three homes to build, I worry that we'll run out of space on land that is easily accessible. A bridge will open things up a bit and make it easier to get to housing plots during construction, hmm? So that's why I'd like you to start by crafting the parts for a bridge base. Get your DIY skills ready. And then you'll want to decide on a prime location for the bridge too. Zap. And done. I just sent you a recipe for a bridge construction kit. You can find it on your Nook phone. Once you've assembled your bridge construction kit, find a good spot for a bridge and then check in with me. It can be a little tricky to place a bridge, but we, but we can talk if you have trouble or need some advice. Good luck, Peotic. Thank you. I will be ba uh, back shortly. I have a general idea for where I'd like to go, and it's just off to the side here. Um, right. Let me open. Oh, wait. Oh, he gave me the recipe. What am I doing? I, like, gotta actually go craft it. <laughs> Ooh. <gasps> Ladybug. Oh, crap. I scared them both. <laughs> oh, well. Too early. Not meant to be yet. Okay. Let's get to crafting. Or I might need to go collecting. Um, let's see. Here we go. So I... Log stakes? Where do I get log stakes? <laughs> Alright, well. I guess I gotta go collect some clay, some stone. The works. There we go. You know what? I guess now that I got the fly, I can pick up this trash finally. Now I just want some ants. Maybe I can buy a miles ticket if I continue doing things around the island. So give me, I don't know, like 30 minutes and we'll see. So I'm just going to be doing a few tasks and then I will check back in shortly. See you in a little bit. I give a fuck, or on vacation. All right, I have just enough for a miles ticket. Because I've already gone through all these rocks and I don't have any clay. Alright, time to get that ticket. Redeem. Alright, Miles ticket. Alright, thank you. Let's see, um, what was the recipe for the bridge again? Oh, Pitfall Seed, there we go. Um, four log stakes, where do I get those? Oh, log stakes, here we go. I need three hardwood. Good lord. <laughs> So that means I need 12 altogether to make four of them. God, I am an idiot for having taken that long to find out. It's fine. We're we're just going through it. Alright, how many... Oh, I have 12 wood. We're good. Alright, log stakes. 
do this a few times. Alright. Um, now I can make the bridge. Which is right here. Craft it. Delicious. Alright. All done for now. Okay, now to begin construction. Um, which part of the river? I kind of like it at this spot right here. Here we go. Build here. Yes, this is the spot. I'm committed. <laughs> Delicious. I picked a spot for a bridge. Let the land connect. I should probably get rid of most of these stumps because they are kind of unsightly. <laughs> All right, let's pay Tom another visit. Thomas Nook. Oh, it's auto doing it. Ah, Peotic, hello, hello. So, did you find a good place to deploy your bridge construction kit? I set it up. Splendid, excellent work, thank you. Then tomorrow we'll have a new bridge up. Oh, then tomorrow we'll have a new bridge up and it'll be even easier to get around the island. Now that that's out of the way, it's time to start on some homes. We can wait for bridge construction to finish if you want, or just ask me what should I do, whenever, hmm? I will just ask you now, because I feel like doing a bunch of things. What should I do? Chaotic, the bridge won't be ready until tomorrow, but you want to start on the homes now? Please take these three housing kits. Cool, I read that in a very weird tone. <laughs> With the housing kits I just gave you, you'll pick out pl you'll pick out plots for three homes. Then, of course, these homes will need furniture and such. Each housing kit comes with a list of the furniture required for its house, so be sure to read those lists. You can build everything DIY style, so let me just send you the recipes you'll need. I think that's all for me. Thanks for all your help. Thank you. Um, I had something on my Nook Miles. DIY furniture. Cool. Handmade resident. Ooh, look at all these. <gasps> I got a ladder recipe. I got a ladder. Hold on, let me make this ladder real quick. I'm so hyped for a ladder. Please don't let there be a WASP. I don't think this apple tree ever grew because it's like on the border next to the beach. So I'm just gonna transfer it <laughs> to somewhere else. Probably like right here. Nursery apple. There we go. Please grow. Ladder. Oh, where are you? Help. Help. Oh, there it is. I can make it. Cool. What if I just throw down like multiple things of pears? Hopefully some ants come by and... Well, maybe if I buy turnips from that girl. I don't know. All right. Let's craft. The ladder. Step ladder, what are you doing? Anyway. <laughs> I finally made a ladder. We're all done, thank you. All right, let's test it out. Ah, I feel so free. Oh, I scared the guy away. I feel so free. Free! Here's a new fossil. Uh, oops, I missed. Alright, let me climb back down to next cranny real quick. Hello, I'm just picking something up real quick. Me shovel. Yes, thank you. Oh, look at all these spruce trees, pine trees, I don't know. There's the little secret cove where I can meet red on some occasions. Oh! That's a tiger beetle. Oh, it just went... <laughs> that is frustrating. It just offed itself. I don't even have a chance to catch it. <sighs> oh, whatever. That's what I get for trying to realign myself. I don't know if I got one of those, one of these already. Yeah. It's a mantis. I already got it. Uh, have I gotten a honeybee? We will find out. Yeah. I have. I hate that I'm so forgetful. <gasps> Release. 
Alright, upstairs to the next level. Oh, there's a orchid mantis thingy. Don't startle it or you're gonna regret it, me. Ja, I got it. Yes, I got an orchid mantis. Our friendship is blooming. Oh, hi. Wait, have I gotten a stink, stink bug? Yeah. I did. God darn it. I think I got it on that island. Okay, I'm gonna donate. Wake up. Wake up. Wake up. Grab right for the little nigga. Hot star made with a shake up. Yes, a sauce. A sauce. Assess this, please. Or these, rather. Ooh, something new. Alright. Oh. I just got these two, apparently. Tricera skull. I'm fine. Alright, let's go sell the rest of these. Thank you, goodbye. Now that all that exploration's out of the way, let's start plotting the location of these new houses. On my last island, I actually had like a little housing, like residential district. This time, I think I'm going to try to spread them out. So we're going to find a couple suitable spots. Like right here. Who wants a beachfront property? Here we go. This is the spot. Neat. Oh, what's going on? My phone is ringing. Hello? At you, Peotic? Yes, yes, this is Tom Nook. How goes your search for housing land? It's going great. Stupendous. I'm relieved to hear that everything is going according to plan. Be sure to check the box in front of the plot for each home. It'll show the items required for that plot. Interior items should be placed in the box, while exterior items should be placed outside around the plot. We want to make it look nice and decorative now, hmm? Once you've set up the plots for all three homes and placed the required items, come report back to me. I'll be waiting in resident services. Thanks again for your help. No problem. Hanging up. Goodbye. <laughs> okay. Let's do interior items. Here. Oh, so I gotta shake some pears. And pot. This smoke, obviously. Okay. Stone tool, stool, table, clothesline. Okay. Stop reading. Maybe I'll go place the other plots first before I'm concerned with any of that stuff, so... Ooh, I bet a lakeside uh, house would look cute. Just enough space. I think that's good. Why is my camera like that? <laughs> I picked a spot for plot two. My phone is ringing. This is such a weird angle. Get me out of it, please. Er, chaotic? It's me again. Sorry for the repeated calls. I forgot to tell you something important. You see, you'll need to get a wreath made from flowers. There are plenty of pretty flowers growing upon the cliffs of the island, so tootle up there if you need to. I've already sent you a recipe for a ladder. It's the ideal tool for when you need to scale those cliffs. Anywho, keep up the good work, hmm? Alright, quickly. There we go. That was so weird. And then, I think this little area back here is nice for the third house. I might be too... Yeah, I'm too close. There we go. Perfect. Nestle it in the little cliff cranny area space. I don't know. I picked a spot for plot three. Oh, no phone call? Alright. Okay, so let me double check this first house. So, all peas. Pears and pot. And then stone items and what else? A clothesline? Okay. I will figure this out. Hey, what are you doing sleeping out here? 10,000 squats. And I'm not even winded. Oh. I couldn't read all of that, but okay. <laughs> Ugh. That was not a comfortable spot. Everything aches. Well, sorry to hear that. Let's see, while I'm outside, uh, let me see these recipes, what am I doing? Let's move over to this. Okay. So I need wood and soft wood. 
Dang it, I think I sold my regular wood already. Now let me just pick up these pears I threw down. Alright, let's get to chopping. Okay, I should have enough wood for these, right? I do. And then, where is the pot? Ooh. I need five clay. I only have one. Um, ooh, what do you have? Please be clay. That'd be really helpful. Probably won't, but... It's nice to hope and dream. Pacifier? You? No. Why? Why would I ever want this? I will definitely sell that. Do they sell clay in here? Oh, I might actually have to use that Miles ticket after all. Hi. Um. Let me just look. I don't think they sell anything like that. Yeah, no. Oh, it's annoying. All right. We're going on a trip in my favorite, well, not rocket ship, but <laughs> an aeroship, if that's what you can call a plane. Hello, Orville. Hey, hey, hey. Welcome to your one and only gateway to the skies, the Grandania Airport. How can I help you out today? I want to fly. Roger. By the way, it looks like you've got a Nook Miles ticket on you, in case you feel like using that. So... Just to get the paperwork all official, where did you want to go? I want to use my ticket, please. My golden ticket to the chocolate factory. <laughs> um, yes. Time for takeoff. Alright, let's get you airborne. Dodo 1, this is Dodo Tower, Wilbur, you copy? Got a walker who needs wings, over. Roger, ready when you are. Okay, have a good flight, friend. And when you need to travel, just think, what would Dodos do? You got it. See you later. Mr. Orwell. All right, we are two down and docked at the target island. Delta, well, Dodo is go. I'm just going to read it like that. Meanwhile, I'll be in a holding pattern here. Get in touch whenever you need tools or travel. Go catch some bees and chop some trees. Oh, who are you? Miss Hippo. She looks like a diva. All right, I am looking at, at the moment for rocks. Hmm, there's a rock. I just really need some clay. <laughs> If you please. S'il vous plaît. Okay. Yes. That's a start. Oh my. What a crazy rock. It only gave me one. One clay. Ooh, there's one up here. Oh, that's a... Okay, there we go. I was going to say, that's a lot of iron. Oh, and that's a lot of clay. Actually, that's just enough. Perfect. Okay. Let's talk to Miss Girl down here. Hello. Oh, you got a rock too. Bertha. I wasn't expecting to meet anyone on this tour. I'm Bertha. And you're Paiotic from Grandania? I'm glad you stopped to talk to me. One thing I love about traveling is a chance to make new friends. She's kind of like, is she the same personality as Midge? That's kind of what I'm getting from her. It must be true what they say about your, oh, about how travel broadens your horizons. This change of scenery is giving me a new perspective on life back on my island. I like it well enough, but... How about move to my island? Move to Grandania? That's an interesting idea. You know, I think I might have gotten in touch with your island about moving there a while ago, Bloop. Bloop. Okay. <laughs> what are the odds that I'd run into someone from Grandania here? Anyway, your support means a lot. I think I'll start packing to move as soon as I get back from this tour. Cool. Let me just uh, harvest your rock real quick. Don't mind me. Let me check out these other recipes too. I don't remember remember what all I needed, but all these stone items seem to be complete. How about the clothesline? Oh, that just needs tree branches. That's not too bad. Um, I don't know what else I need. Maybe a classic picture... Oh, but if I did this and I only have two, I wouldn't have enough to complete that. Oh. Alright, we're gonna... Oh, hey, another rock. I didn't see that. Please move out of the way. Please. Oh, there's also not enough room anyway. Oh, well. I think I might have enough clay, though. For both of those, if I need to make both. 
And then I don't think I'm gonna go fishing or anything here, so let's just return home. Because I got everything everything I need. Um, I'm ready to go home. Ready to pump pontoons, blah blah blah. Be very positive. Yep, I'm positive. Roger, lifting off November Oscar Whisker. See you later. Thank you. Goodbye. Um, let me make the donation quick. Who? Oh dear, pardon me. Yes, um, quickly, look at this. Ooh. Oh, it's a mammoth torso. But we already got it. Ah, alright. Nope, we're good. Goodbye, thank you. <laughs> okay, thanks, bye. Okay. Let's go and make a few things. Okay. Should I craft something? Ah, uh, yes. Okay, so... I will do the pot. Oh, I should have grabbed sticks. Oh well, let me just finish crafting these and I'll get those. Yeah, let me go grab the uh, thingums. The twigs. The FKA twigs. Anyway. Alright. Please don't let there be a wasp. A lot of sticks. Oh my. Here we go. Alright, let's go back. Yes, I should craft something. It's always a good idea. Um, keep crafting. Because I still need to make a stone stool, or table, and a stool. Alright, that's all the stuff for the first house. Let's go check it out. Um, here is the plot. Check the interior items. Submit items. I turned in three items. All the required interior items are ready for this home. Brilliant. Okay, and then exterior. I could just leave them outside, right? Okay, stop reading. I will just um, go ahead and place these out here then. And then right behind it, we'll put the stool. Yeah. Here we go. Ah, that's perfect. Okay. Clothesline can go on the other side. Maybe I'll push it back. I love how there's just random clothes on this thing, like... Do they even belong to the... Who do these belong to? Whatever. <laughs> I guess I won't think too much about it. Alright, let's start checking out the next house. Here it is. Okay, what do I need? Interior. Wooden block stereo table. Cosmos wreath. I need to go get those cosmos. Exterior. Natural garden, chair, table, and a bird bath. All right, stop reading. Okay, I need three yellow, three white, three red. No problem. Here's one of each. Oops, there we go. Okay, there's three red. And I need one more white. There we go. I have all three of each type. And let me just double check. I already forgot what I need. Set of wooden block, terio, terio, stereo, and table. Okay. Let's focus on those next. Wood block table. Oh wait, how to make a wooden block toy? Oh, there's a birdhouse. I need more wood. I just need more wood in general. Oh, I can make the natural garden stuff. Oh, there it is. Okay, I just need more wood in general. Yeah. Is somebody gonna match my freak? Well, maybe I have enough um wood for these things. So let me just hop back over here. Oh. He's talking to me. Ah, Peotic. Hello, hello. So, how goes it? Progressing nicely with the plots and the homes and the furnishings and whatnot? It's all going smoothly. Wonderful. That's what I like to hear. As you finish your part, I'll get started on home construction and welcoming our new residents. I vow to get this done quickly and to get it done right. Well, oh, why? If it all goes well, we could have someone in a new home as soon as tomorrow. By the way, I plan on letting the island know about folks moving in or out during my island broadcasts. However, once I know who will move into a certain home, I'll post the info on the sign for that plot. If you're curious, check the signs. Anywho, keep up the good work. Thank you. I'm going to craft things on your bench. Okay, um, I need to make two D's. And then... Let's start making um, the other things. I can make a wooden block. Oh wait, I already forgot. Is it the table and chair? 
Shoot. <laughs> Oh, I do need a, I do need more wood for several things actually. Uh, well, let's make the natural garden stuff, and then the wreath. There we go. Oh, I think it was a bird bath that I need to make. There we go. All right, I made a bird bath. All right, let's go check out the list. I need to remember what I need. All right, uh, interior items. There's a wooden block table, stereo, and cosmos wreath. Okay. I will submit the wreath. And then... I need to double check what things outside. There's a bird bath. I'm glad I got it right. Okay. Well, I guess I can set the bird bath here. Wait. Where, oh, is it this? Yes, it is. Place item. And then the table and chair. There's a chair. And the table... Ah, uh, shoot. There we go. There's a table and chair. Oh yeah, I need the axe. I can't chop wood without an axe. Am I... Am I stupid or something? There we go. Back to the flimsy tools. Alright, let's start getting these trees. Oh no. Run inside. Ooh, run inside. Oh no. Oh, you fiends. Well, <laughs> dang it. Okay, I guess I'll finish chopping. Um, okay. Yeah, I can make both of these. Okay. Oh wait, that's not the table. That's a bookshelf. Where is the table? Oh, I can make that too. Okay, we got the chair. <gasps> oh no! I just realized I didn't want to make the chair. Oops. I'm so stupid. All right, here's a table. And I just used up the rest of my softwood. Oh my lord, okay. I'm kind of pissed at myself right now. All right, let me get some more softwood from outside. Somebody gonna match my freak? Okay, don't mess this up. Okay, make the toy first. And then the stereo, not the chair. The stereo. There we go. Alright, let's go turn these things in. Okay. Uh, check interior. Alright. We're done with home number two. What's on the agenda for home three? Okay, wooden simple bed, wooden chair, classic picture. Do I have enough clay for that? Hmm. And then... Log stuff with a wooden bucket. Alright. Here goes nothing. Okay, so a simple wooden bed. What do I need? I need 17 stuff to... Okay. <laughs> That's fine. Uh, I could do a log bench and a dining table. They look like the same thing. One just looks thinner than the other. And then, what was it? A simple wooden bed? I already forgot. Bed, chair, picture. Okay, let's get to crafting. Let's see, I will do the interior things first. So, simple bed. 18, that's already so much. Why do I need to use 18? Uh, keep crafting. Okay, a uh, chair. That's six. Oh, I'm not gonna have enough for all of this. Let's do the picture. Okay. Um, the bucket. But now I won't have enough for the, uh, dining table and bench for outside. Oh, wait, these are comfortable. Because <gasps> he used hardwood. Oh, that's brilliant. <laughs> that is brilliant. A log bench and a log dining table. I am a genius. <laughs> I can't believe that I made all of these in one sitting. One, two... Oh, and good thing I made just enough, because my inventory is full. I think I can put the bench and table on this side. Oh, wait, let's do the table first. Oh, okay. Um, let me pull it out a couple... Yeah. And then we'll put the bench over here. Oh, I have no room. Okay. I guess I will... Have it on this side then. Place. 
Here you go. Oh, that's already so snug. I love it. And then I guess the bucket will just go here. All right. Well, we've done it. Uh, let me go talk to Tom. And then after that, I think we'll pretty much just time travel to tomorrow because we're still behind. So yeah. Hi, Tom. Ah, Payotic. Hello, hello. How have things gone since we last spoke? Are you close to finishing the plots and furniture? Everything's finished. Goodness, really? Thank you so much for all your hard work. Now to hurry with the rest of the construction and welcome residents to their homes. And that's that, my friend. You have finished everything I asked of you. Ah, let me give you a token of my appreciation as promised. Yes, yes, this is for you. My right kidney. Oh, it's a fence. It's some fencing. You could surround your home to create a yard or surround some flowers to make a garden. Fencing should make it easier for you to create yards or parks or other outdoor areas. I'm positive this will lead to some interesting new lands landscaping scenes here on Grandania. I'm thinking 50 pieces of simple wooden fencing should give you an excellent start. In the future, I'll offer DIY fencing recipes you can get by redeeming Nook Miles. The selection will change daily and will offer a variety of designs. Check the Nook Stop some- oh, check the Nook Stop sometime, hmm? Well, I couldn't have done this without you, Peotic. That's for certain. Cool. We got that done. Oh, I'm excited. Um... I can sell some things, probably. Ooh. <gasps> I can catch him. I can't really tell how close I am, so I hope this is it. Oh, shoot. Yeah. There we go. I got him. Yes, I got a tiger beetle. I pounced first. I guess we'll talk to Blathers real quick. Eek, a tiger beetle? What a wretched thing. Um, yes, please tell me. The tiger beetle is extremely fleet of foot, though it runs in a rather peculiar way. That is, it sprints, then stops, then sprints again, using these speedy maneuvers to run down its prey. You see, the tiger beetle, like a real tiger, is a powerful predator. The mere thought of it giving chase gives me the willies. Tigers are terrifying at any size. Any hoot. Alright, thank you. Actually, no. I think what we're going to do is, after everyone moves in, we're just going to check in, say hi to everybody, and then we'll wrap up the episode. So, that sounds like a plan. Oh, I got to sell the rest of my things before I do any of that. Um, yeah. Oh, wait, I forgot these pairs. Yeah, that looks like everything. 7,030 bells. Thank you. And bugs don't bug me. Actually, they do. I'm sorry to break it to you. Night Owl, Insect. I haven't even played this game at nighttime yet. What do you mean? Do I have anything else? Uh, there was a new thing, but nothing I've earned, so we're good. I want to go peek and see who all is moving in, so let's do that real quick before I uh, exit the game and time travel to tomorrow. Alright, sold to whom? Ooh, who's Clay? Hmm, there's like 400 villagers, so I have no idea who everyone is. A handful of people, yeah, but not everyone. Uh, this is Bianca, okay. And then is this... The girl I just talked to on the island? Bertha, yeah. Alright. Good to know. Alright, so that's all the people who are moving in tomorrow. Um, I guess we will save here and I will come back in a few moments. Tomorrow. It's a new dawn. It's a new day. And I'm feeling good. Now for today's news. Rondania gained a new neighbor today, Bianca. What about the other two? I'm sure she'll be very busy unpacking today, so consider checking in on her. Alright, it's time for our final announcement of the day. For all of you DIY-loving island residents out there, I have a very special announcement. DIY veterans can now take part in a special customization workshop I'm hosting. Learning how to customize will help you change up the look of any DIY projects you create, hmm? I have no doubt it will broaden your creative expertise. I'll conduct this DIY workshop inside resident services. Curious crafters should stop by. That's all for me. Time for you all to get out and enjoy your day. Yes, yes. Thank you, Tom. And now the live news at 
1. Wait, what time is it? Like, about 1 p.m. on here. Anyway. <laughs> hmm, what's in the mail? Gulliver. Oh, that's right. It's Gulliver. Spoiler warning for the end of this letter. Please accept this gift, blah, blah, blah. Thank you. <laughs> so just impolite. I'm like, ooh, gimme. It is... Oh, a Sphinx. I wonder where I could put that. Wait a minute, these clouds. These are like serious clouds. Are these one of the special clouds, like the cumul uh, cumulonimbus and stuff that happen in the background sometimes? Is this special weather? I don't know, I'd have to... I kind of want to use a Meteor Nook later on and kind of predict things like... Oh, hello! Harvey. Hey. Yeah. Hey. You live on this island? Thought so. I'm from, like, the next island over. My name's Harvey. Glad to meet your friend. You can call me Harv if you want. Wonder why no one ever does that. Is a v, is a v part just fun to say? I don't know. <laughs> Sorry. Got a bit sidetracked there. Came here for a reason. Give me a minute and I'll remember why. Got it. I keep hearing about this island and how much folks dig the, uh, dig the scene here. So I thought I'd check it out. I'm going to start this far out artist collective and I'm looking for ideas. So, what's the deal? I've heard that this place was deserted. Like, literally a deserted island. You the honcho that put this place at the head of the class? Wait. This old noodle just had a casserole of an idea. You should visit my island. Just hit the airport and tell him you want to visit Harv's island. That's the name of my pad. Groovy, right? Yeah, how original. Anyway. <laughs> nice John with you. I'm gonna stroll around and see what makes Grandania tick. Alright. I'm not going to visit your island just yet because we're working with a little time crunch, but yeah. Oh, here's Bianca's house. <gasps> oh, Red's here too. Oh, there's so much happening. Well, well. You from around here? Hi, the name's Red. I work in sales. And you are... Chaotic? What a great name. Intelligent. Strong. I can already tell we're going to be pals. No, not pals. Family. Chaotic. It's a pleasure to meet you, Chaotic. Hey. Would you mind if I ran an idea by you? So Gondani wants art, and I got art to sell. Might be something to this. But I couldn't sell to just anybody. I'd need someone I could trust. Completely. As if they were family. And since we're basically cousins... Uh... uh sure, pal. <laughs> and because I know you got an eye for quality, I want it to be you. Wanna look, wanna look at a few things? I've got both art and furniture. Plus you'd get my cousin's, cousin's discount. You in? Sure, I'm in. I knew it could count on you, cousin. That is absolutely the right choice. I've got my boat anchored off the northern shore, and I'm almost done fixing all the leaks. Long story. Come have a look at what I'm selling. You won't regret it. Sure, uh, let me check in with my... F Wait, are we going right now? Oh, okay. Yeah, let me check in with my friend here. Bianca? Oh, I thought you were an elephant. I don't know why. <laughs> my mind is um, all sorts of fubbernucked. Oh, hey, thanks for, your, thanks for your suggestion the other day. You're all right. This island is look gorgeous. I'm so excited for my new life here. Let's catch up once I'm done unpacking. All right, see you around. Good luck. All that. Okay, let's pay a red a visit. Oh, there's a message in a bottle. To whoever's into strange bottles, I set my mind to making up the next big thing in DIY recipes. And lo and behold, I had this genius idea. My great idea is in this bottle here. Take a chance on it. You'll see. Try it and see what happens. Better get on it. Marlo. Thank you, Marlo. Oh, a lily crown. That's cute. I like that. Here's Red's boat. Ah, Peonic. I'm so glad you made it. So here's a pitch. Ready? At Jolly Red's treasure trawler, we sell only the finest. And there's nothing finer than fine art and rare furniture, am I right? Of course, I can't let all these fine things just walk out the door. I gotta limit you to one piece of art per day. It's a hassle, I know. But I hope the cousin's discount will make up for it. Plus, I'll let you buy all the furniture you want, no questions asked. So take a look around. You've got masterpieces by the great masters, plus stuff for your master bedroom. Let me know if you have any questions. Okay, thank you. Uh, ooh, the Mona Lisa. I won't lie. Oh, uh, we, we get the gist. <laughs> um, I want a closer look, please. 
Um, oh, she doesn't have eyebrows. I think the false version has eyebrows, so I'm gonna get this. I'm gonna buy it. Sold. You are not gonna regret this. Oh, I'll take your word for it. <laughs> it's all there. Congratulations. All right, thank you. I'll get it tomorrow. I don't really want your other stuff. I'll see you later. <laughs> you won't regret it. Uh, sure. Well, I think I made a pretty good decision. But well, we'll find out uh, later when he ships it to me, so... Well, we've made a lot of progress this episode, but unfortunately that is going to be all the time that we have for today. So, we will continue in the next episode. If you liked everything you saw, make sure you like, comment, share, and subscribe. And to hit that little notification bell to stay up to date on future content just like this. My name's Peotic, signing off. Bye!